Okay, so there are some very common misconceptions when it comes to the concept of what a VPN is. Some people think that it's just like a catch-all for privacy, but in reality, there are two types of VPNs that most people are going to want to use. One is more of the traditional virtual private network. So that would say, let's say you have a computer at home. In that computer at home, you want to run certain applications, almost like web apps, but they're not on the regular internet. They're behind a firewall where it's safe. The benefit of this is you connect to that network through the VPN, your virtual private network, and then you open the browser, go to your URLs that are only available on your local network, and then you can access them anywhere. This is very safe. This is actually how businesses traditionally have used VPNs. Then there's the other side of the whole VPN circle where a lot of people use these services like PIA, um, they're, they're purchased VPN connections. You're not connecting to your network. You're simply connecting to a network that is designed to help anonymize your data. So what happens if you have one application that you need to connect through a VPN for your private network, but you also want to do some of this obscure stuff that PIA would offer you? Well, this is where VPNify comes in, a very handy Unix tool that I'm going to show you guys how to use right now. The idea behind this is sometimes you are using different VPNs for different reasons. Sometimes you have a VPN that you need to connect for some kind of intranet that you're running, and then another one you want to do for, I don't know, protecting your IP from the MPA and using BitDonor sites. And you can run multiple versions of your VPN on one interface easily. Now, you could do this if you know how to modify your own IP tables or whatever, but this really simplifies and streamlines the process. Um, so for example, you set up, you do your VPNify sudo open VPN and then whatever VPN settings you have. And then on another terminal, you just VPNify the program. So to show off this, I'm just gonna do a real simple one here. So first thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go lynx duckduckgo gg and this is through my regular internet connection i'm gonna go my ip there's my ip address so using vpnify i do vpnify sudo open vpn let's do my west now again this is 96 something 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 14 now if we do home vpn phi vpn hold on <laughs> it's gonna ask for the password again my ip now it's doing 137224 which is the ip address of one of the popular um pia services that's with vpi on and if I go out of this and just do it without my IP, it goes right back to my real VP IP address. So this is a really awesome program. You also have the ability to run multiple ones. If you just got a software link, the binary. And the binary, from what you can tell, is all bash. It just kind of uses all the built-in tools you already have. I think as long as you have OpenVPN installed, it should work as expected. So with VPNify, you can take advantage of having multiple types of VPN connection, connect easily, connect quickly, connect to your work, connect to your home server, and of course, connect to your PIA or whatever you're using. Um, so I hope this helps out. Let me know if you uh, use VPN services or you run your own VPN server from home, which is something I need to get into because I haven't done that yet, hopefully in a future video. Um, all right, guys. Peace.